and we are back with part three of Resident Evil Village. Let's play. Uh, let's continue. All right, so we are in Luisa's house from our last time. Uh, let's see what happens now. Hmm. Come inside, the others are waiting. What the fuck is this? Outsiders, you're gonna get us all killed! Right, Anton. He helped Leonardo and Elena. We were doing fine by ourselves. Please, okay. take a seat. Is this all that's left? From your entire village? All that's left? There is no one left! A worthless invalid! A stupid, wailing bitch! And you! You drag a bloody man and an outsider in here like it's nothing? And expect to be all safe? There is no safe! Every sorry bastard out there has been ripped in half! Tomorrow we'll all be dead. Just like her damn husband. <laughs> Put a sock in it, Roxana! That's enough! This house has protected my family for generations. And drunk or not, you are all welcome and safe in here. Whatever. Can someone please tell me what the hell is going on here? We don't know. One day we were a quiet, devout village and the next... The monsters came and attacked us. And they... they kept coming. Wait, Louisa. And... Where is your husband? Did they... No. N no, he, he is out there. Somewhere. He, he, he went to get help. Yes, yes, that's... that's it. He, he went to fetch help. Okay. Let us pray. For him. For all of us. Good idea. Come. Gather. Great ones, hear our voice. Together as one in reverence, we call on thee within the endless dark to deliver us into fate's hands. As the midnight moon rises on black wings, so we make our sacrifice and await the light at the end. In life and in death, we give you glory, Mother Miranda. Now, the tea should be ready. Come help me, Elena, please. That prayer, I've heard it before. There was an old woman near the graveyard. <laughs> Some bitch is crazy as a bag of rats. There is wisdom in her devotion, though. And I hope it protected her as it shall protect us. <laughs> oh, shit. Leonardo, what's wrong? Are you okay? Oh, No! There's nothing you can do! Papa! Oh, 
This entire place is collapsing. You couldn't save him. He was already gone. Leave me alone. No, we're getting out of here. Together. Okay. So that happened. He turned into a werewolf, I guess. Or a lichen, the official term for this uh, whole wearable thing. Um, I guess that's how all the villagers have turned into this, you know, into lichens. Okay. All right. So I need to get out of here. Uh, find a place to. Uh... The fire spreading. Okay. Nothing here. Oh, uh, where's the... There's an herb. Nothing here. Can go up, maybe. Uh, oh. Nothing on this drawer. Uh, cabinet, sir. Oh, got some money. Lay, as they call it. Truck key. Okay. Examine item in more detail, you'll find some new clues. So... Oh. Okay, got a screwdriver. Uh, take the screwdriver out of the keyring if you need it. Nice, shotgun shells. All right. Some pistol ammo, some shotgun ammo, should be good to go. Don't have anything else here, as far as I can tell. Uh, the upper cabinets are clear, nothing here. Alright, time to go. Damn, the fire's moving fast. <coughs> time to go now. Um, what is this screwdriver for? That's my question. I don't think I need it for... Let me investigate. A small screwdriver that was once a keyring. Probably gonna be using it later for something. Alright. Maybe to open a lock? What are you thinking? Step back. We can bust out with this. Try not to breathe in the smoke. Yeah, get out of there. Thank you, Ethan. <coughs> you're kind. I hope your family is safe. I do too. Once we get out of here, maybe you'll get to meet them. <coughs> Careful! Come on, it'll hold. <sighs> there, that's our way out. Thank God. We'll figure it out. Hey, don't talk like that. We'll find a safe house to put you in until I can find my daughter. My hunch is she's in that old castle. 
No. That place is full of nothing but blood and death. And I don't want to be alone while you're... Father? Elena, no. That's not him. He's... Not more. <laughs> he said my name. Father! Wait, it's not safe! John! <laughs> Stay there! Come on! Give me your hand! She's gonna die. Ethan, go! Save your daughter! Elena, don't give up! Reach for me! God damn it! I miss. Why is everyone dying on me? This is, this is just too much. I mean, she's not supposed to run up, run up to him like that. You know, the whole thing's gonna collapse anyways. And he's not himself anymore. He's not his father, so... I just... I don't get it. Anyway. Matt. Yeah, true. Why the fuck is this happening again? <laughs> oh, shit. This, uh. Ethan can't just catch a break. Okay. Uh, time to get out of here. Nothing to see here. Okay. Oh, yeah, the screwdriver. I can use it here. Right. Is it a one time use only? Yes, yep, seems to be. We got a demon pressed. And those two combined should be enough to open the door at the castle. The demon pressed and the maiden pressed. Alright. Whoa! Chill! Uh. Wait. sure what that was. I don't want to find out though. Really don't want to find out. Also, I hope those fucking werewolf creatures are not here anymore because the bell has been tolled. Never mind, they're here. Oh god. Run! Okay, what am I doing here? Gonna get the shotgun ready in case. Hmm. Some rusted scrap. Ooh, more shotgun ammo. Nice. Ah, I can climb more out of the window here. Okay. Um, okay. Do I, or have I missed anything else? No, this is cleared up.
There. Some money here. Um, I think that's about it. Yeah. Let's move forward. Nothing. Let me double check here. Nothing. Oh no, it's not nothing. I got a handgun ammo. See? I missed some of the loot here. Let me check. Hmm. So this perch area, I am still red. Uh, these are all blue, so I have already looted that. Okay. Death. Huh? Yes. Death has visited them all. Okay. <laughs> okay. Are you gonna just stand there? Yeah, you're gonna stand there. She's insane. <laughs> I don't know. Um, so the church is red. So there is something. Ooh, what's... Ooh! A crystal fragment? Okay, that's new. And that's blue now. Nice, I got the loot. Okay, nothing else here. Save the game again just in case, because playing on hardcore, so gonna get fucked up. Um, locked, locked. Uh, this one though, this crest. Uh, Uh Okay. And this one goes there. Nice. Oh boy, I think that's Nothing this but blood and death. I got an achievement, Hunter. Ah, I got 300 lei for that, I mean money. So it's something like uh, Resident Evil 4 where if you kill the crows or some of the other enemies, they will drop some items for you. So that's great. Oh, can I drop down here? Yeah, I can. To what end though? Secrets? Any secrets here? No. How about here? Nope. Nothing to see here. Hmm. This side, nothing. Alright, I guess that's the start of the castle area. Oh boy. Oh boy. So... Hmm. Okay, so this one. Well, well. Uh oh. Uh oh. Didn't think anyone was left. You must be pretty tough. Huh. Uh oh. Who are you? Oh, you're not local. Even better. Ah! What the fuck? Mother Miranda is gonna love you. Ah, <laughs> uh, what the fuck just happened? Wait, you're whining. We're almost there. <laughs> uh, he's a psychic or some shit. He has a force power. Or something. The man is of no real use to anyone else, and my daughters do so love entertaining foreigners. <sighs> Furthermore, I can show them that you entrust the mortal to have. What the fuck? My daughters and I will deliver to you. 
What the fuck is going on here? You mean you'll screw around with him in private? Where's the fun in that? Give him to me, and I'll put on a show that everybody can enjoy. Ugh, so gauche. What do we care for so bread gauche? and circuses? The man thing's suffering is assured. Yak, yak, if a man's dick is cut off in the castle, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> uh oh. I've heard all your arguments. Some of you were less persuasive than others, but I've made my decision. Heisenberg, the man's fate is in your hands. Mother Miranda, I must protest. Heisenberg is but a child, and his devotion to you is questionable. Give the mortal to me, and I will ensure he is ready. Shut your damn up! And don't be a sore loser! You'll find your food somewhere else. Quiet now, child. Adults are talking. I'm the uh, child. You're the one who's arguing with Miranda's decision. You wouldn't know responsibility if it was welded oh, to Oh, keep glory! Hand. One day your head might actually fit your ego! Fight! Fight! Hey, fight! Don't fight, I get a fight, say in this? Silence! <laughs> My decision is final. There will be no argument. Remember from whence you came. Thank you. Huh. Lycans and gentlemen! We thank you for waiting. And now let the games begin! Uh-oh. Let's see what you have here. Ethan Winters. Get ready. No way! Ten. Nine. What? Eight. Seven. Uh oh, run! Ah, Jesus Christ! Run! That's right! Run for your life! Nope! Oh no! Go, go, go! Go, go, go! Oh shit! Very nice, Ethan! <laughs> oh. oh my god! Oh shit! Ah! Uh. Oh no! Go! Crouch! Shit! Okay. <laughs> We are out. My word. You truly are as strong as they say. Oh no, something's gonna pop up here. Oh, you people think I've let you get away. Fuck my. Gotta keep Donna and the row entertained. So now it's time for the view. The Lord Soaps. Grand. Rip. <laughs> What the fuck? Jesus. <laughs> this game, man. Ah, Jesus Christ! That's right. Run for your life. <laughs> Very nice, Jesus. <laughs> You're still 
Also, how is it talking to me? We don't have like a walkie talkie here. Shit! Oh my god, look at this. <laughs> you truly are as strong as they say. Okay. Um about this one though, how the fuck do I How the fuck do I Aha! Uh -huh. Found it! Found it! Oh! You don't think I'd let you get away? Gotta keep Dada and Moreau entertained! So now it's time for the view! The Lord Salt Grand Finale! Oh god! Something <laughs> <laughs> like the Grand American Grand Beast! Ha <laughs> ha Jesus! Do those freaks have rows? Four lords. I get an achievement from that. I get four handgun ammo and some money. Man, this gonna this game's gonna be like really good in VR mode. Uh, just like Resident Evil Seven. But that, okay, but that was insane though. The whole sequence. Holy crap! All right. So what about ro I mean, and it's saw so all those lords, the four lords, quote unquote. Uh, Whoa, so that's uh, Mother Miranda, Lady Dimitrescu, the other guy with the hammer, and some old lady and the pips quick. So I guess uh, we'll be fighting them eventually. God, there's another trap there. Hey. Also, the werewolves. I guess there's a lot. Of, oh my god. A lot of werewolves in this game. Lo and, oh, lichens, not werewolves. We call them lichens. Okay, then. Oh, we have the weapons with us. Okay. Okay then. Uh, this one is closed off. Can I break this? Nope. Okay. Now we're on the other side. Right. Nothing to loot here, as far as I can tell. Yeah, clear. Cleared up. Okay. <sighs> All right, let's move forward. Hmm. Hmm. Ooh, okay. We are now at the castle area proper. Wait. Nice, got some more money out of them. I do have some money to spare, so you know. I mean, so well, bullets to spare, so why not? Uh, ooh. Some hurt. I hear... I hear that thingy... There! Oh, come on! <laughs> I have to spend a bullet for that. Fine. The weapon sound effect is nice. Uh, really well put. Like, there's a punch to it every time you shoot something. Uh, no, there's an impact. You feel like you're shooting a gun here. So, well done. And the sound, uh, it reverbs into the environment here. So, you know, we're in an open space and you shoot something, it just reverbs all around this place. So, it gives it a little more punch to it. Okay, so. Oh. I've been waiting for you, Mr. Winter. Okay, the merchant, yeah. How do you know my name? Oh, boy. Anyone who is anyone has heard of the likes of you. A hero searching for his daughter. Though I must say, that castle arouses suspicion. Yeah, and so do you. 
I am but a humble merchant. <laughs> Here? Oh, forgive my manners. Call me the Duke. Now to business. The Duke. Weapons, ammunition, healing salves, anything you desire, I can provide. Okay. We have our new merchant of Resident Evil 8. Uh, not the same one as 4, but <laughs> this guy, a big boy here. Let's Welcome. see what he... Oh, oh, now here's something I haven't seen before. Oh, let's see what he has to sell. I have like 3,410 lei. Hmm. So I have, su they have supplies. He has supplies, gunsmithy, and the Duke's purse. So let me sell some item, I guess. Uh... I'm buying this because of our relationship, you know. Okay. Um, so the handgun is Limai, the shotgun is M1897. Ooh, it gives me like a lot of money for that, but I don't want to sell that. Okay. Let's look at the supplies here. Mm. Hmm. Extra baggage for 10,000? Nah. Increase the number of item slots available in your inventory. Yeah, I can do that, but later. So, the, you know, the Resident Evil 4 inventory system with a briefcase. Uh, so it's back. That's why you can increase that and get more space if you want. 3,000 for... Sh oh, recipe for shotgun ammo. Ooh, I could use that. Do I have to make shotgun ammo using the crafting menu? I might get that because I'm going to be needing a lot of shotgun ammo. Recipe for sniper rifle, uh, for mines, lockpick, zero. A tool for opening simple locks, each can only be used once. The cost is zero? Okay. Uh -huh. well, I'll take it. <laughs> oh, this one is cost zero as well. I'll take it as well. Free stuff. Uh, first aid med. Recovery item, medicine that fully heals all wounds, closes gases and acts as a clotting agent while restoring function to damage system. Uh -huh. Take that. Uh, I'm a patron now. Achievement unlock. Um, <laughs> handgun ammo. Um, nine millimeter parabellum round for handgun, generic round that have Little stopping power, but are easy to handle. I'll take that too. Oh, I can take all of them? Nice. Sure, why not? I think I got this because I pre-ordered the game, so they gave me some free stuff. <laughs> and some shotgun shell as well. Excellent. 12 gauge shot shells. Uh, each shell has a wide burst, packing a powerful punch. All right. Selection. Nice. Um, what's this? Mr. Raccoon Weapon Charm, customizable part, customizable uh, part for a shotgun equipped for a dangly charm. Limited item. Sure. Aha. Um, sure. All right, so what else is here? Okay, so M1897 hair trigger um, greatly increases rate of fire. And uh, greatly increases ammo capacity. Now nah, I'm good to go in this part. Do you have enough firepower? I can now offer an expanded weapon modification service. Oh. Oh, okay. The Duke will now upgrade your weapons for a price. Hmm. Okay, so I have the option to upgrade my handgun or my shotgun. So I will be naturally going for the shotgun because the more stopping power it has within a single shot, the better. For the handgun, yeah, but shotgun will do more you know, close range damage up front. You don't quite have the cash on hand. Fuck. Well, in that case, hmm. Nah, I'll just put it in reserve. Till next we meet. I'll just save the money and I'll upgrade him, upgrade my uh, 
shotgun for the next time. Um, I think that's about it for this area. Let's go down to this castle. Okay. The mush, mush is pretty cool. I like him. Uh, a lot, a bit more chatty than the uh, Resident Evil 4 Martian. Could Rose so, be here? Um, you know, which I like. The more interaction you can do while <laughs> purchasing stuff, the better. Okay, so I got some gunpowder. Also, nice to shotgun shells. You can break the jars to get those items, like, you know, some hidden items, just like Resident Evil 4. So this game is kind of inspired from that while having its own unique formula and identity. So, you know, I like that so far. Okay, so 5th, uh, January 5th, Rednik, delivery to one male, three female, uh, de delivery of one male, three female, uh, January 28th, Mother Miranda, uh, meeting with Mistress uh, Dimitrisk, February 1st, the Duke business discussions. Hmm. So the Duke is probably part of this castle, part of this uh, whole charade here. Okay, so what it says here? So this looks identical sisters or daughters. Three daughters, Bella, Cassandra, and Daniela. Oh, okay. I think I know who they are. I saw from the trailer, those are, uh, you know, the lady that flies away or just forms from insects and shit. Probably them before they were twisted into. Ooh, money. Uh, how much do I have? Seven thousand seven hundred. Damn it. I need three hundred more. Hmm. I got with me hmm, pretty decent amount of shotgun shells. Eleven. Okay. Uh, nothing here. Okay. Lock from the other side, of course. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, come on. I like need 70. 70 uh, lay to buy, to upgrade my shotgun. To be careful now. I want to. Good. That's my footstep. <laughs> the fuck was that? Oh shit. Pristine footstep sound. I like that. What is this though? Looks like it's a hole for something special. Something's uh, spherical. Okay. Save the game. For uh, what's this? Uh, Norstein's Labyrinth. Norstein's. Norstein's Labyrinth. A craftsman of the late nineteenth century, Norstein was branded a heretic in his homeland. He uh, wandered the land until he settled in a remote village. Nordstein then created four labyrinths, the castle, the house on a hill, the water wheel, and the iron tower. Upon their completion, he put a gun to his temple and took his own life. Each labyrinth is unique and requires its own specially crafted metal ball to operate. Each one contains crystallized human remains, which are said to be Nordstein's four beloved wives. Uh, the labyrinths are their graves. Okay. Do I have to be venturing into these four labyrinths myself? That's my question. Probably. Probably. Okay, so where do I go now? Look for Rose in the castle. So I'm in the castle area proper. Uh huh. Statue here. Uh. Oh no! Oh. 
fresh prey. You are so kind to me, daughters. <laughs> oh no. There she is. Now. There she is. Let's take a look at him. Well, well, Ethan Winters. You escaped my little brother's idiot games, did you? Let's see how special you are. Yes, mother. Yes, mother. Uh. <laughs> oh. Oh boy. <laughs> There she is. Oh boy. Oh, you. Okay then. Hmm. Starting to go a little stale. Then let's devour his man flesh quickly, Mother. But I am the one who captured him. Now, now, daughters. First, I must inform Mother Miranda. But later, well, there will be enough for everyone. What am I? Uh <laughs> Oh, be careful what you wish for, Ethan Winters. <laughs> wait, 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 what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Man, the uh, <laughs> the whole uh, the whole charade, the animation, and everything. God damn, this is next level shit. But uh, well, now I'm kind of uh, yep tied up. Oh god. I don't know if I can... Oof! Shit! Yeah! Shit, man! Oh my god. The uh, magic healing item cure to everything, even like when you're impaled on your hand, in in your hand and all. <laughs> it's gonna be fine. Holy shit! Look at this. Oh, it is not gonna be a good day, man. <laughs> he just can't seem to get a break. Fuck you know. Oh, this seems to be a lever. But, uh, yeah, here we are. Back at it again. <laughs> From the village uh, to the castle. Um, From the frying pan into the oven. So uh, now we gotta deal with those, this shit again. Okay. We have our weapons with us. Okay. Oh, so that's a charm, huh? The weapon charm. Uh, kind of annoying if you're going to be fumbling around this thing. I don't know. All right. Um, get a lockpick. Petty thief. Ooh, more shotgun shells. Nice. Hmm. Hmm. Anything else? Like, uh, this game is nicely detailed, like all the little items here that you see. Very nicely put, like, you know, it feels like this place has been lived in for a long time now. Like, you see, even down to the dust, they're settled here, it's like an old, decrepit. Very nicely detailed. Uh, what's this? 
Maidens of the Harvest. Hey. And uh, this, oh boy, this is blood. God. I mean, they're vampires, I'm guessing, since they drink blood. So uh, they drip this whole fruit basket here. I mean, this fruit platter here with blood. And off to the other side. I think you see here, I'm gonna have to go down there. Let me see if there's anything else I need to check. No secrets. All right then. Okay, time to go down here. Ooh, rats, damn. Well, rats shouldn't be, that should be the least of our problem because like, you know, the, all the shit that we face, rats are like nothing. Uh, and you see the sound effect is also really nicely done, like, see the, the knife hitting the on uh, objects here, really punchy. Okay. Maroon eye ring. What's the status on my inventory? I still got a little bit of space left. Also, uh, no, no. Uh, there. Oh, okay. I can break that. All right. I hope these knights don't come alive and try to kill me. There were some knights there on Resident Evil Seven that did in fact come alive and had to fight them. Okay. Yeah, it's a lot more enjoyable than Resident Evil 7, uh, this game. Um, so it kind of like you'll be exploring this entire area, trying to find loot. Uh, the fighting mechanic seems much better. A uh, lot more NPCs and enemies that are, that are like talking to you, interacting with you and all. Um, finding all these items. Uh, this is one of, that was one of the fun parts about Resident Evil 4. Then you kill all the enemies and you get rewarded for it. You get some money, you get some item, you upgrade your weapon. And, Where have they taken Rose? And uh, you know, also the puzzle system. I'm guessing. I'm guessing there that's back. Uh, that was one of the other staples of uh, Resident Evil games, was the puzzles, so... Okay. Oh, he's back! Oh, we meet again! Duke, why are you here? Where there's coin to be made. <clears throat> and have you found your daughter? No. If she is truly here, the lady of the castle would have kept little Rose in her private chambers. Private she chambers? Dimitrescu? The very same. Dimitrescu. Why don't you take a look? Maybe you'll get lucky. And speaking of looking, care to make a purchase? Well, and uh, also, how did he even move his whole, like, the way he is his entire body and all like look at this how does he even move around like this um but yeah I, so far i like this merchant here like he's inquiring about uh our search for rose just talking about you know general stuff helping us a bit giving us some tips you wish to make a purchase um and he Despite Securing the goods is more important than anything. Anything, my friend. Yeah, and I we can just chit chat. I like this, you know, small chit chats here. Good stuff. So I'm gonna sell this. Uh, oops, sell this, sell this as well. I don't think there's anything else. Your coin. Nice. 13,000. Now I'm going to upgrade my shotgun from 560 to 640. Fair enough. Mm -hmm. 
supplies. I think I will save the rest of the money. What are you buying? <laughs> Just something an old friend of mine used to say. <laughs> nice. Nice. Good. See? Thank you for your patronage. So, old friend. So, that's official then. So, it is official. This guy is a friend of uh, the merchant from Resident Evil 4. Excellent. Love it. Awesome. Uh, so, the guys at Capcom, they do know how to homage from the previous games. Because they know that, you know, we like the Resident Evil uh, merchant from 4. So, <laughs> good stuff. Okay. Um, Where to then? Uh, not there, I uh, just came from there. I guess we just go to the middle. Oh, but before that... Uh, some things... Uh, the Angel of Sadness weeps alone in a deep, dark place. The Angel of Anger looks down in rage from on high. Oh boy, this is gonna be one part, hell of a puzzle then. The Angel of Pleasure appreciates art. Best kept behind the gilded door. And the Angel of Happiness, Happiness's Visage, looks on words of wisdom by her side. That's the word of wisdom. Okay, I guess I should like move around this uh, statue here, maybe. Or interact or something. What is their sound? What is that? Break all the shit. Not my castle, so I don't care. Oh. Oh. Ammo. What the fuck is making that sound? Werewolf? I mean, lichen. I just keep saying werewolf. Okay, I think the sound stopped. Um, right, now where to go? There's a uh, place on the top, the bottom as well. Hmm. Ooh, examine. Ah! Uh, blood? Ooh. So someone's been recently here drinking blood? God. Okay, then. <clears throat> Some money, nothing here. Nothing here as well. Can I open this? Go for the other stuff if you go up. It's okay. Okay. Yeah. Like, look at the details, man. God damn. Very, very nice. Uh, Even the details of the carpet here, look at this. Like even like something spilled here, you can see the details as well. Capcom did a really, really good job at making this game. I mean, no wonder like it's getting so much sales and uh, concurrent player base. Like as uh, of this recording, there's like more than 100,000 players playing this game simultaneously as of today. So, and it's gonna only grow as the days go by. I mean, it's gonna get like a few million sales in the first few weeks easily not even like in a and there's no doubt about that all right so i'm gonna have to go there eventually but let me just explore wine room uh hello oh camp fluid my inventory is uh oh yeah because Oh, that's one of the good things here, uh, which I kept, I just noticed. So they don't uh, clutter your in ingredients into the actual inventory system, okay? Like the crafting materials is all here, but it won't take up any space, any additional space, which is great. Because like in seven, whatever you picked up, it just piled up in your actual inventory and you were not able to pick up all the actual necessary items like you know where your weapons or any key items and stuff good job on this one 
Okay, so the winemaking techniques of Castle uh, Dimitris can be traced as far back as the 15th century, uh, long before the current occupant of the castle. Uh, Alkina Dimitri used, uses this legendary yet particular technique to enrich the wine's flavor, in flavor intensity and bestow it in a thick bouquet. Uh, her best vintage is uh, Sangui Virginis, means uh, uh, maiden's blood. Okay. It is kept in a special ornate bottle decorated with intricate silver flowers. Should it be relevant in the future? I'm not sure yet, but what's this? A special bottle adorned with flower. Okay. I'm guessing I have to like place a bottle here, like a wine bottle. Oh yeah, I think the, the bottle he's speaking of sanguine virginis or something i have to like pick it up place it here it's gonna open up something probably this uh this here Ooh, something here i don't know probably for later all right then nothing to see here um how about two hundred lay Lock from the other side, of course. And this is giving me the the Resident Evil, the RPD, you know, the Raccoon City Police Department that uh, from Resident Evil 2 is giving me that vibe. You know, it has that whole ground floor and the second floor. It has to go to different areas. Uh, initially, they'll be unlocked, but you'll be able to uh, explore the whole police de department and then go from the other side, open those shortcuts and, uh, you know, yeah, it's taking like cues from all the other games, I'm guessing. So maroon eye ring, uh, an eye shaped gem is loosely set in the string. It looks like it will come out. It's an object. So I need to investigate this ring here. Uh, oh, and uh, there you go. I cannot place this eye on this statue here. Which will open up this. Oh, uh oh. Run! <laughs> so I know this part because I played the demo before. Even though it's a blind playthrough, I did play the demo just a little bit to see, like, you know, how the game runs. So first time I was like fucking fumbling, going back and forth, back and forth, like nowhere to go. Like, goddamn, <laughs> I was shooting this that lady there, but uh, well. They're not a lady, but still, I just call this call <laughs> the lady for now. Um, June 9th, 1958. It was my first day at, uh, working at the castle today. I was almost, sorry, I was most shocked to see the other staff were all women. The mistress and her daughters were very adamant that they wouldn't fight. Hmm, it was quite peculiar. June 23rd, 1958. It's been two weeks since I started working at the castle and I'm a little afraid. Another maid, Adela, uh, made a mistake and Miss Daniela uh, slashed her face with a knife. Oh shit, okay. And at night I can hear wailing as if ghosts roam the halls. Oh god. I want to go home. July 8, 1958. I don't know. So this, okay. I don't know what to do. The young ladies were complaining it was too hot and stuffy during dinner, so I opened the window. Just a crack. Uh, shut it. Shut it now. They all shrieked at me in unison. I fear I may be taken down into the cellar, never to be seen, again, seen of again. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Okay, so... So... I 
I'm guessing they're afraid of this. Oh, yeah, they're vampires, so they're afraid of sunlight. Probably. Um, okay. Also, this entry is from 1958, and this is this year, like in the game, is 2020. So and they're still young, quote unquote. So I'm guessing they are. I mean, of course, they're vampires. So the vampires are supposed to be immortals, and they're supposed to be forever young, right? So uh, okay, that's good to know. Now what? What's this music, man? Oh shit! It's Lady Dimitris or Mommy. Uh, should I shouldn't? Okay. Holy shit! Look at her. She's so massive. Uh, more handgun ammo. God damn! I'm getting so. <laughs> I I already have like over hundred, almost yeah, over one hundred. Hang on, of course, that's gonna just get burned out uh, once they start shooting people. But as you saw, one of those lichens take like 14 bullets to kill each on this difficulty, so uh, yeah. Still, I just have to reserve my ammo as much as I can because shit's gonna go down hard. This game, the enemies are more tougher. That's the thing, like, you know, the enemies are tougher, but they're more challenging. Uh, um, and they, well, this game has both quantity and quality, I think. Uh, just like Resident Evil 4. So that game also had, like, you know, a lot of enemies coming at you. They were relatively strong, but also uh, with enough weapon and firepower you'd be able to take him down you'd be able to take him down so yeah uh the balance is so far good um so far so good i'll have to see another encounter like an actual encounter see what happens there okay easy enough uh all right, my flashlight. I remember this part as well, kind of. Uh, it's covered in dried blood. Mm. It's, a, it's a torture chamber, a dungeon, maybe? Or oh, this? Help me, brother. Hmm. Let me see if I... Uh, oh, okay. Let me see if I can... What the fuck is that? Oh, yuck. Aha, red. Wait! Tasting room. So this is also red. Oh, but that's, uh, that's where uh, that, that uh, creepy lady was. Chasing me, so I can't. I couldn't uh, loot that place. Uh, let me read this first. Candidates: Irina, uh, Michaela, Luis, Ingrid. Uh, rejects: uh, Dandora, Greta, Nadina, Camilla, Bianca, Melina, Astrid, Lud, Mila, Rosalinda, Lina, Stefina, and Gabriela. Okay, so they're like probably. Experimenting on them, just like seven. Oh no! Again? Do they, do they ever learn? I don't know. Just speculating here. Probably experimenting on them. Oh god! Shit! Oh boy, something, something's a mess. Ooh, Irina, robust appetite, Michaela. They're all females though. Robust appetite, Louise. Robust appetite, Ingrid. 
Unstable, overly alert attack. Are they making vampires out of them or something? I'm not sure. Like, they're all girls or females, so... Hmm... Oh, shit! What the fuck? Okay. Uh-oh. Shotgun time? Oh no. Don't kill me. Oh god. Not looking good. Metal strap. What am I doing here? Uh oh. Uh oh. Hi, bomb. No. Come on then. Okay. Shit. Nope. Got him! Uh oh, there's more. Sounds like it. Sir! Wow, 
All right. <laughs> As you can see, the ammo burns down really fast. Oh, okay. That's why I need to like be extremely conservative and only fight when I need to. Okay, this uh, room requires something. Cassandra caused all this mess. Stop! Oh no! What a purple face. <laughs> What's with that FPS? Nope. What am I doing? <laughs> Shit. Not bad. God damn it. Oh, loot. Okay, go. More loot. Go, go. Oh, shit. Kind of wasting ammo here. Yeah, I'm gonna <laughs> redo that, but a bit better. Um, cuz... I need to explore the surrounding area before... I can't believe Cassandra caused all this mess. No, oh, never mind. Restart again. Finding the optimal route, so this is gonna be the optimal route here. I believe Cassandra caused all this mess. This here run. <laughs> run. Give up! 
<laughs> I got the crystal torso. How much healing items did I use? Fuck my life. Ah, uh, it's all right. At least I got it through. Still got myself decent enough ammo, but that was crazy though. Yeah. Well, uh, I guess one of her sisters is dead. Uh, <laughs> okay. Shit. Uh, what did I get though? Okay, so uh, uh, Dimitri's daughter's crystallized remains. Valuable. Okay, I, I don't think uh, Lady Dimitri's gonna like that, that I killed one of her daughters. Uh, <laughs> Like, oh god. What the fuck is this? Is this a kitchen area? Alright, so another one was sent to the cellar. She had only spilled some soup. Uh, everyone knows what happened when you're sent to the cellar. You're never seen again. They drain your blood. Your soul curse to wander the halls. Oh no, we have ghosts here as well. I went looking for her, but when I found her, she was just skin and bones and gnawing on a rat carcass. I suspect uh, it'll be my turn next. Oh, God. Okay, then. Good to know. Time to get out of here. Oh, my God. Look at this. What the fuck is this? Oh, this is the bottle. This is the bottle that I need to put in the... Uh, God. That uh, base. Yeah, uh, Sanguis Virginis. More handgun ammo, thank you. Some more rusted scrap. I need to cra uh, get the uh, the recipe for the, well, the shotgun shells. Oh, easy to pick lock. What is this? Lemai. Recoil compensator. Ooh, nice. Uh, customer. Tab. Equip parts in your inventory to weapon. Equip parts. Nice. So, I guess it's gonna make it more stable. I forgot to read the description, but okay. <laughs> Examine. Oh, so there you go. Uh, leave my cast. Recall compensator. Customizable part to increase firepower. Oh, okay. Nice. Good shit. All right. I'm liking it. Very, very good job with this whole thing. I got a lockpick as well. Nice. Oh, wait. There's a... Okay, no. I thought I was going to have to open this door with a lockpick, but nope. I can just do it with this. What I got? Wooden angel status, uh, statue. Uh, which is probably going to be a treasure. Uh, yep. Angel statue carefully carved from uh, wood family. All right. All right. This game is so far very awesome. Love it. Love it a lot. Okay. Uh, where am I now? A dinner table? More gunpowder. I'm getting so much stuff. Like weapons and ammo and crafting ingredients. Like, holy shit. Which also means there's going to be a lot of fights in this game, a lot of action, more than uh, Resident Evil 7. It's going to be like 4, basically, um, where the, that game was also, you know, packed with a lot of action. Uh, this one is like hybrid, action and scare, all in one punch, or uh, only one game, so... Hmm, mm, nothing below me. Okay. Let's open this door. And uh, oh, it takes me to the other side. Okay. Okay. All right. Now I need to go back and save. Uh, run. Like, look at this lighting, man. So good. Welcome, welcome. You're sure to find something new. Okay. Uh, sure. But first, save. All right. Okay. I've played enough for today. Uh, for this part, it's going to end here. I'll continue 
from tomorrow onward. I'm having a lot of fun. Trust me, this game is awesome. Like, really, really good. They're just blowing my expectations so far. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna continue tomorrow. Uh, hope you all enjoyed it, and uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Take care now. Bye.